video, you're going to watch me call a for sale by owner who says she's already got an offer. It was easy to handle this objection. I asked her a few more clever questions and within four minutes she gave me the other objection, which is I got to talk to my husband and 30 seconds later, I set the appointment. So in this video, what you're going to discover is exactly how to never accept a no when a yes is still possible. Watch. Hello. Uh, yes. Hi, I'm calling about the property uh, over on uh, in, in McKinney. Is this the owner? Yes. Fantastic. Uh, my name is Shadi. What's your name, ma'am? Amanda. Amanda. Amanda, is the property still for sale or did you already sell it? It is still for sale. Um, I do have an offer I was thinking about taking today. Oh, good. Well, hey, congratulations on, on getting an offer. Hopefully it's a good one for you. Uh, were you interested? Well, you know what? I do sell real estate for KW Keller Williams here, and I just wanted to offer my services to you and find out if there's anything that I can do to help you at this time. Oh, no, we're not trying to go through real estate agent. Got it. Are you at least cooperating with an agent if someone's got a good offer for you or not? Yes, I am. Okay. What What's the compensation on that, if you don't mind me asking? Um, None. It's just a friend. Oh, so you, you have a friend. Okay. So if if, yes. if if I have a buyer and I wanted to, you know, get, get your property sold, are you like, comp, would you compensate me for that or not? I don't think I have to worry about that right now. Got it. Got it. And, and you were asking $275,000, correct? Yes. I uh, got it. What's the offer for? Um, two hundred thirty. dollars Okay. Can I just be upfront and honest with you? Okay. Even without seeing your property, it's worth more than that. Okay. Okay. So if there was a way that I can get you more money than what you're currently entertaining, or at least let me review this offer for you and help you negotiate the price up, would that create a problem for you uh, at all, Amanda? Um, no, but I'm just wondering where would you get your number at? Well, you know, that's one of the things that I specialize in, me and my team, my partner, Donna. Over the course of the last 12 months, we've helped 22 for sale by owners like yourself net more money than they thought they can get. One of them, we got them $60,000 more. One of them, when the market was a little bit hotter, we got them $150,000 more. Now, I'm not promising you that I can get you these numbers. The only promise that I can give, give you is that your property is worth more. Can we come by this afternoon, sit down with you for 15 minutes and share with you the data, and then you make a decision with no obligation? Uh, sure, can I call you back? Absolutely, absolutely. So let me let me give you uh, my, my partner's number. Her name is Donna. Okay? okay. And the number is Okay. Okay. And and Amanda, while I got you on the line right now, are you available this afternoon? I mean, it's like 11:30 right now, like maybe 1:30, 2 o'clock, maybe 3 o'clock. Um possibly I have to speak with my husband first. Got it. Okay. So you thought I I respect that. Okay? You you have whatever conversation you want to have. The only reason I'm asking you is because we're pretty full for today and I'd hate for you to lose thirty, forty thousand dollars by not knowing how to handle the 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 offer. So yeah. can I at least pencil you in for right now and I'll have Donna call you to confirm? Sure. Okay, so you pick the time, three or four? Uh, I guess three. Okay, three o'clock it is. We'll see you at three o'clock. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye. So I, I think it, it's clear to see of the opportunities that exist out there when you get out of your freaking damn head and I tell you to memorize your freaking damn script and you freaking damn memorize the script in a way to where it doesn't flow like the script. And if you guys are familiar with the script, I'm using the script that I've given you guys. OK, except I just don't buy into what they say. I repeat what they said. I approve what they said. I speak with confidence. I speak with conviction and we just keep on rolling. 